stuff coming up from, I'm seeing uh, condensation towards the ground. True, brother. It's not, if it's not on the ground, it's very close to it. Yeah, you can definitely see that. This is a developing oh, uh, situation, developing tornado. There you go, you see it? There you see it. Yeah, that was on the, on, the on the ground. That's on the ground. And a tornado. Tornado on the ground. There's a tornado. All right, we've got this tornado, and again, this is going to be, I'm still detecting it, it yeah. uh, just a wipers. couple miles north north of Newcastle, Rusty. I want to bring Chris, it's Rusty, can you hear me? Yes, we're looking almost due west from down 149th Street. Okay, it's going to cross the river momentarily, Chris. Let me know when you see that happen. Okay, uh, this is going to, more than likely, it's going to stay going east here, so this is going to cross over the Canadian River. We're still just a few miles, what it looks like, just north of Newcastle. Again, this is going to be just north of Newcastle within this. Looking at the velocity, look at the picture right there. This is tightening up. This rotation here, you can see this, this tornado. This is the early the stages street. of this tornado right here. You can see it right here moving to the east. As we pan across here, you can see this coming in from Chris Lee and Bastion. Look at that. Chance yeah. I see you. We got, we got it on it's three different people. Okay, I'm right here by it. Okay, we may be talking to you here in a little bit. Hang on. Okay. Now, as it continues to move to the east here, tornado right here. Now is a perfectly good time to make sure that you download the KOCO5 tornado app and the KOCO app as well. You can watch our streaming coverage as you go into your tornado okay. shelter. Again, you can see this right here. This is going to be near Southwest 159th Street in May. Large tornado on the ground. Chris, give us your exact location right now. We are right between uh, we're right between Penn and May on uh, 149th. We're looking uh, just south of due west on 149th. It looks like it's south of 149th. Looks like maybe getting ready to come across the river right about now. It's north of that uh, power plant uh, that's along uh, the river. There. And this is a this is a very old tornado, and we have watched it go from just a very thin rope-like tornado to now what looks here. Debris flying in the air from the base, Damon. Okay, that is a large tornado now moving into Cleveland County. This is a large tornado moving into Cleveland County. This is coming in from Chance Cold Iron. You can see what appears to be that debris. Looks like we're getting debris in there, and that tornado is getting even larger. That is a very large tornado. This is going to be moving in your direction again for western parts of Cleveland County there. Uh, we southwest 149th Street, southwest 134th Street. We'll go south of 134. That is an old Oh, hit a house, hit a house. Street and more. Chance Cold Iron, you're live on the phone right now. Go ahead, go. Damon, this tornado's turned into a violent stovepipe. It just hit a house or a barn. We've got debris flying everywhere. Uh, it's where it's a quarter mile west of I-44 and the river. Uh, it's, it's, a mile, it's about a mile and a half west of the river. Um, this is going to be, uh, let me see here, uh, 37. It should be coming up on 37, but it's violent now. We're in the high-end EF3 range on this tornado, and it's um, it's going, to, it's uh, 37 where uh, McDonald's is, and all the gas stations is just to the west, and it's doing damage, major damage. We're going to follow it here uh, as it's going to cross uh, I-44, but... Uh, it's getting it's getting a lot larger. It's a couple, uh, couple hundred yards okay. wide right now as we speak. Chance, right exactly where are you right now? Where I, are you? I am uh, Highway 37 and I-44. It just crossed Highway 37, and it is moving uh, northeast up towards uh, I-44. Okay, Chance, where are you in comparison to the first Moore exit off of I-44, otherwise known as Southwest 149th Street? Are you near there? We're two miles south there. It just, okay, missed, it, it just missed the Brahms and McDonald's at the Newcastle exit on Highway 37. Okay, okay you're at the Newcastle exit okay, along Highway 37 right there. That is generally looks like it is going to be crossing over the Canadian River there. Okay, so Damon, Damon, this, Damon, this thing is mean. Yeah, go ahead, go. What do you think? Damon, people in Westmore need to be underground on this tornado. We have debris, large, large chunks of debris. If, uh, give me just one second. Uh, it's going to cross right over the bridge on I-44 and come in on 149th. I got you a view right here. It's going to pass right in front of me. Okay, this here, is going to be a, this is a here it very is, Damon. large tornado. We have this large is, debris in the air. Here it is, Damon, right in front of me. That are living 
and West Moore. If you're living along Southwest 149th Street, South Pennsylvania Avenue, Southwest 164th Street, Southwest 179th Street, otherwise known as Indian Hills Road, as you make way uh, just west of the Westmore Trail Park, west of the Moore Golf and Out Athletic Club, yeah, uh, Southwest 134th Street. This is a large tornado that is now moving into uh, can you western right part of it's as bright as it goes, Cleveland right? County, Rusty winds that could be in excess of 150 miles now or perhaps even higher than that. Uh, these will be in okay, comparison. Stop. This tornado will be in comparison to the Shawnee Carney tornadoes EF4, maybe even higher. Tornado emergency is now coming. We do have a tornado emergency for this storm that is moving into more oh, right now. Great, this is a tornado emergency. This is higher than a tornado warning. This is the most significant of all warnings that we can issue when it comes to a tornado, okay? This is more significant than a tornado warning. A tornado emergency is now in effect for Cleveland, McLean, and Oklahoma County. Danielle Dozier, go. Why are they taking us? Okay, we're at, 100, we're at 149th in South Bay. Just saw a power flash in the sky, Damon. This is a large violent tornado. It is moving to the northeast, and we, we're, we're looking at it right now. It's moving to the east northeast generally, but I mean, if you are in Moore, I would go ahead and get underground right now. Violent tornado, and this thing is kicking up debris. We just zoomed in. We saw the debris. Now, of course, the trees are a little bit in the way, so we can't see it actually at the ground, but this is Definitely causing a lot of damage right now. We're going to need to get out of here because it's going to come, uh, is this a little too close to where Okay, we're yeah, Chris, so right along Southwest 149th Street, that is in Oklahoma City. Southwest 149th Street, as it moves into Moore, becomes Southwest 19th Street. We're talking about Moore City limits street between Southwest 19th and 4th Street. In the Oklahoma City area, Southwest 134th Street and 149th Street, south of 164th Street. This is a tornado emergency. You need to be below ground there. immediately. You need to be below ground immediately. Now is the time to go into your tornado shelter. We are not here to scare you, but this is a very large tornado. And we want you to understand the tone that we are using right now as a very serious situation, a life-threatening situation as we have this large tornado on the ground. We hear the tornado sirens, they are going off. We need to take the tornado uh, siren seriously, take our warning very seriously. Again, a large tornado is moving now in the western the uh, Do you have this tornado going over the river as we speak? I do believe it is starting to turn more deep. We get these large tornadoes that become right turners. They head more to you. So right now, I have it just south of Southwest 149th Street. Let me say this, and I'm going to say this to as serious as I've ever said in the seven years I've been here. If you are not underground on the path of this storm, you are endangering your life. This yeah. is the kind of tornado that is going to be coming into the western side of the floor. You have to be on half the path of this tornado. Jan, you still there? No, you, you gotta get me on, man. That's Just cross the river on I-44. Okay, we're getting ready to go to you. Damon, this is a this is going F5 right now. It just crossed the river. Uh, I think I seen two cars get picked up off the bridge and thrown in the air. This thing is violent. People have to be like underground, just like Rusty's saying. We got power lines down. The old bridge on I-44, the metal bridge, has been taken down, and that that's some strong winds. People need to be uh, in their shelter. The exact location of the tornado is going to be just to the south of 149th 
on 49th Street moving due east right now. Okay, I am detecting debris in this storm with our radar. You can see the radar on the right hand feet. side of your television screen there. That piece of shading that you see right there, that is debris that is in this storm. So this is a large modern tornado, a tornado emergency has been issued from Cleveland County and Southern Oklahoma County. Although if this storm turns more right, this is going to stay more in the Cleveland County here. So right along Southwest 149th Street, I am detecting some significant right. debris within this tornado right here from our radar and it gets southwest 149th Street, turns into southwest 19th Street into more. That will put it on the track that would take it into the street.